Hi everyone. Here we have a Best WCP 3i30SB wall hood. And what I'm going to show today is, you know, how to get at the main components for changing. Um, we're going to look at how to change the lights, um, how to change the switch assembly, and all, all main components. First thing to do, always make sure you have your safety gear on. Um, first thing you would do is we, you would remove the filters. And it's basically, you're just pushing down and pulling out their spring tension that holds them in. This light repanel removes by removing two screws. There's one on the left and one on the right. And I'm gonna go ahead and move these two screws. That's one. That's two. And there's actually a third one. There's one in the center as well. So three screws, light panel comes down. Here are your light assemblies. These are just pulled. And there you can get at the light assemblies. Light assemblies, they're actually like a push tab. Just push them in, they'll, they'll pop right out for you. So I'm going to go ahead and set that light panel on the side. All right. As far as the switch assembly, the switch assembly is located right here in, in the nose of the hood. What I'm going to do, I'm going to remove this panel here. Um, there's a few screws there's a screw here a screw here there's also a screw in the center and there's one on each side and I'm gonna go ahead and and get these removed here That's two. That's three. And that's four. And there'll be one more in the center here. And once those screws are removed, this plate comes out. So here you have access to the transformer, to just a screw on each side. And I can just kind of let this hang here. Remember this is sitting on a table. Um, it's not mounted on the wall just for filming purposes. Um, located up inside this unit here is the switch assembly. And there's going to be a screw here and a screw here. And I'm going to go ahead and, and remove these screws here. Everything is plug and play. And there is the switch assembly. And again, these are all just quick connects. They can just pull apart and there you have the switch assembly. And all you would do is repeat the process for installing the new parts. Um, if you have any questions, please call our technical support. I hope this video helps.